Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. And today's video, we're going to be doing a review of the new Batman Avengers by DC Collectibles, Batgirl. Yes, I picked her up on eBay for the low price of $20 plus shipping. And I'm super excited to have her because I don't have her in my collection. And I'm very excited to have her. And I'm super pumped for it because I've been looking forward to get her. So, yeah, so we're going to be unboxing her and get a closer look. And let's get to it, you guys. So here we go. Alrighty, so now we got her out of the box. So let's get a closer look on her. On her accessories so here we have here where we're gonna move Batgirl out of the side so she, we're gonna go over with this one so she um, most likely um, comes with her um, display case where they tell the instructions where they show you what they have so you could see that um oh, hold on a sec right there so you can see right here that uh you can display her whatsoever, and then you can remove her arm, her hand, right here you could see. And for the rest, this is basically it, so nothing too particularly, so we'll move that on the side. Next, we do have the DC collectibles list on seeing what we can get and whatsoever, so we're going to get a closer look on what she has. So right here, you could see that... Um, she, she, um, I do have Batgirl, of course, and then I have the Penguin, and then I'm getting Roxy, and then I have most likely uh, Nightwing, Bane, Scarecrow, and Manhattan. So that's mostly I have, and that's and the only thing I do not have is. Rocket Roxy, which I'm planning to get her soon. And the only one I do not have is just the Riddler and Batman. Alrighty, so let's get a closer look, guys, on her accessories. Uh, she does come with a display stand alongside with these two. And here's one thing that that bothered me the most was that um this right here, her it broke suddenly because... The one thing that bothered me was that why DC has to um, to do something like very, very difficult to make it so small or whatsoever. But I'm very upset that this broke, but I'm planning to maybe get it glued or do um, super glue on it. So that's what I'm going to do. And then right here it comes with her her weapon, the bat symbol. Wing, and then we have a couple accessories with her hands. Um, this one right here, she comes with, and then a couple more hands whatsoever. But now let's get a closer look on on Batgirl. So yeah, so let's get to it, guys. Alrighty, guys, let's get a closer look on Batgirl. So let's see how her arms go. It goes all the way to the front and then to the side yep there it goes her elbow her joints and whatsoever and then let's check her elbows a bit and, um, don't want to break it a bit okay yeah there's a little bit of elbows there yep and then right here um the other one as always and then um her hands of course they do go upside down a bit so and then you have her legs moves back and forth and then it goes to the joint to the back and then right here you could see that um her her boots move to the side a bit and then but let's take a look at the details on her design and uh, the bat costume i think dc did an amazing job with it and the symbol right here, you can see if you get a closer look on it, it looks amazing. Same one for like the new Batman Adventures. The belt, they did a great job on it. That's what I like about it. And then on the back, you can see that the belt is still the same. Now for the cape, it's exactly just like from the new Batman Adventures. Except that there's a little bit of paint on it missing, so... Well, no, no worries on it. But next, we do have the hair. Barbara Gordon's hair, which is super nice, so red and 
nice details on it. The blue eyes, the it's really nice. The details on the blue eyes. It's, you may look at, but you could tell it looks gray or white, but it's blue when I'm looking at it. So I really like how they did a great job on it. And the mask, I think they did a good job too. So I think this is the best uh, DC collectibles figure that... I have ever gotten in this is and then the last thing right here the, the gloves they look good on the details on it so just how it, I like it about so yeah um well now we're gonna get to our final uh um thoughts on the Batgirl so yeah so let's get to it guys and let's get to our final thoughts Alrighty guys, so here's um, our final thoughts. So I'm, I have Batgirl with the rest of the gang, which Batman, Nightwing, and Robin. And I'll be definitely reviewing Robin and Nightwing soon. So, but let's take, let's get a closer on our final thoughts. I feel like, you know, um, DC did an amazing job with Batgirl, no doubt about it. And the details, they did a great job with the, uh, like the cartoon whatsoever. And I am very amazed how they did a great job, how um, the design of Batgirl did. And, you know, DC did an amazing job. And I'm going to give this Batgirl 10 out of 10. Thanks to DC, you know, you did a great job. But now I'm going to ask you guys, see if you want me to get the uh, Batgirl from Batman the Animated Series so I can do a review compared to the Batgirl from the New Adventures. So leave in the comments down below. And we can go from there. And without further ado, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more. Peace.